Welcome to 365 Combat Remote Carlton here, joined once again by the flawless Sawyer Stein. And tonight we have another epic card. Four matches on this one, but ooh, all right. You know what? We're, not even, we're gonna start it off with. We're starting off with the 365 Pro Wrestling Championship. It is gonna be absolutely epic as Eddie Osborne challenges. He's finally getting his match. He's finally getting his shot. At, at the bout, he's challenging Devin Shooter for the 365 Pro Wrestling Championship. It's going to be absolutely epic. Then we have in singles competition, we have the mayor of Monkey Flip City, That's right. the ringmaster of the Fallen Circus, Avico, taking on Mad Max Benson. Ooh. I don't know. That's gonna be a good one. It's going to be great. And I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna skip the next match. I'll tell you what. Don't worry about. It, don't worry about it. the final match of the evening. Singles competition. We have Judas Icarus, one half of the Sinner Saint combination, going against none other than Inferno. It's going to be epic. And that third match of the night, it is a fatal five way. Five, count of one, two, three, four, five way, and you're in. But we'll worry about that later. Right now, we have making their way to the ring. Wow. People like him, people like him. Eddie Osborne being um, uh, accompanied by, uh, by, uh, by, yeah. Where did he go? Where, well, I was wondering where Sawyer went. Yeah, no, he's down there at ringside. I know, he's down there at ringside. He's just there. Let me get, let me get back to me. I don't care if he's on here. Get real. All right, Ramon Carlton will hold the, uh, the the floor down here for a bit because anything can happen here at 365 Pro Wrestling, and sometimes we read the schedule, sometimes we don't. Talk and wait. The story is not there. Now he's here. All anyway, right, let's go down ringside. We'll figure out what's going on. Karen the intern here with 365 Pro Wrestling and the one and only Devin Shooter. Devin, you got the hardware, it looks beautiful. I've only been close to that belt one other time. It's gorgeous. The reason this belt looks this good because it's on this shoulder. One thing you need to understand, tonight it's me and Eddie Osborne. Eddie I've been through the 365 Pro Wrestling locker room. There's not one person standing that has stood, let's say stood, in my way. They've all tried and they've all fallen. Tonight, let me say one thing. The same result will occur. Albert Einstein said trying the same thing all the time is complete stupidity. So why do you guys keep trying? I'm the champ, and the champ I'll remain. See you tonight. All right, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. You heard it here first. I'm Karen, the intern. That was Devin Shooter, and we are 365. All right, Eddie Osborne uh, demanding his title match. He's getting his title match. He is very enthusiastic by this. The uh, one half of the 365 Tag Team Champion, of course, Eddie Osborne. And uh, maybe the other half of the Tag Team Champions uh, will come back being uh, Sawyer Stein. I don't know. Anything can happen here. But making their way to ringside now is uh, Devin Shooter. All right, Devin Shooter making his way to ringside. Eddie Osborne uh, getting ready, kind of waiting for Devin Shooter to make his appearance. All that kind of good stuff. Um, uh, and there you go, you hear it. Devin Shooter making his way to the ring, holding his wrench. A definite two on one advantage at this point as Eddie Osborne um, is standing all alone in the ring. Not a friend in sight as Sawyer Stein has made his way back behind stage. There is a, 
There you are. Hey. Yeah. I know. I know. Obligations. Obligations. Um. Uh, that's okay. You think they would put this on the sheet or something? That's okay. Although I don't. Hey, did you hear we're getting a new camera person? Really? Oh, we found one. This time we're going to tether them to the ring. Oh, well, we, should, we should do that. We don't want the ring to get sucked into the ring. Didn't think about that, did you? Oh, yeah. It was like a big guy. Okay, um, we'll see what happens. I don't think he's on the card tonight. I think I don't think Thelonious is on the card tonight. So we should be fine tonight, but yeah. Um, because he already gone and get a rope, so I probably should stop him. Anyway, okay, back to here. Uh, we'll leave the fifth dimension alone for now. We have Devin Shooter uh, taking on Eddie Osborne for the 365 Pro Wrestling Championship. Let's go down the ringside, Sydney Strode. Devin Shooter there uh, went recently to say greatest country of the world, uh, South Africa, which is actually at the bottom of Africa, because on the south, go figure. Yeah. And um, he uh, defended that belt, the 365 Pro Wrestling Championship, successfully twice, which is really good because now we don't gotta go back and get it. Yeah, that's true. And uh, from what I've seen, they've been great title defenses. Oh yeah, they're amazing, amazing. And and things are flippy floppy over there in um, uh, South Africa. People were cheering for Devin Shooter. Huh. I know. Maybe it's because we're up north. I don't know. Like, does it tilt on an axis? Is that okay? I have no idea. Maybe it's like the toilet's going the up direction or that. It doesn't matter. All right. What matters right now? Eddie Osborne, uh, Devin Shooter um, are here at the White Eagle Polish Hall. And Osborne not waiting for anything. Shooter up and over. Oh, and right working on the knee. Oh! oh! One of those massive back elbows he's been loving throwing. They hurt. Okay, Shooter has Osborne down. Osborne quick offense, but Shooter was able to counter it. Shooter um, in a little bit of trouble. Oh, no, sorry. Osborne in a little bit of trouble here as Shooter fully in control. Just beating down Eddie Osborne. Not much referee Tim Chason can do here at the moment. Oh. oh! What a shot by Shooter. It's going to take more than beer at this moment to get Osborne back on his feet. Shooter uh, just using the hatred of the crowd to power himself up. You can just feel the more they boo, the stronger he gets. It's like the muscles start dancing. I look, it looks like he's arguing with that guy and his shoulders are doing his shoulder thing. Yeah, the shooter totally in control here so far. Now, if Osborne wants to have any chance at this title shot that he has been waiting so long for, he better do something now because he's not going to be getting another one anytime soon. Oh. oh, Osborne down, your tag partner. Feeling the effect of the big boots of Shooter. Shooter off the ropes. Oh, that elbow to the back of the head. Oh, Osborne is down and out. If he gets up from that, I will be... Well, he is getting up. I am surprised. How is he getting up from that? I don't know. Because he prefaced that back elbow with two sharp super kicks. So well, he may be up, but he has no idea where Shooter is. But he's out. Oh, yeah. He is out on his feet. Shooter leaving the ring. Osborne went out the other side. He needs a beer. Shooter taking advantage of it. Only got till the count of 10. Referee's discretion, of course. Whatever the count has started. Shooter picking Osborne up by the feet. Picks him up, drags him, and push. Oh, oh. fake landed to the ring pole. And Osborne's down. He ain't moving. And Shooter's waiting in the room. Crisscross applesauce. Okay. Well, the count 
count is going on. This may be an easy victory for Shooter. All he needs to do is wait. Counts at seven. No sign of Eddie. Eddie is out on the outside. Shooter, wait, Shooter leaves the ring. So doesn't want to count out. Interrupting the count. Osborne slowly getting to his feet. All right, Shooter and Osborne back in the ring. Not to the advantage of Osborne at all. Oh, from corner to corner. Oh. Okay. How how is how is Eddie standing on his feet, Sawyer? This isn't. What, how does Eddie even moving? Oh, this is pure. Oh, oh it means nothing. Corner. It meant nothing, or it meant everything. It meant they're both down. They're now. both down. It meant everything there. Osborne somehow was able to get Shooter out of that or into that as Shooter is down, trying to recover. Osborne on his feet first. Osborne feeling the power of the crowd pumping up. Oh, if he only had a beer. Shooter, oh, he caught Shooter's arm. Oh, oh there was an elbow of his own. Oh, the forearm. Oh. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh, we tossed Shooter like last week's bag of wet salmon right across the ring. Butterfly suplex, a thing of beauty there. Oh, he's got him up again. Oh, oh the driver. Oh, that's it. That's it. New champion. Oh, Shooter oh. kicked out. What a minute. How did it? Nobody kicks out of that. What a minute. I, I, I don't think I've ever seen anybody uh, kick out of that. I've seen it. That's impossible. It's going to take way more than beer here, folks. Eddie Osborne dug down deep. He fought back. He he did it. He executed perfectly. And Shooter kicked out. No, Shooter ain't moving, but Shooter kicked out, which means she, uh, Osborne should do something really quickly here. But Osborne feeling the, the effects of that beat down that he had at the hands of Devin Shooter. Where is Eddie going? He's going up. Eddie doesn't go up. I know. What's he doing up there? Oh, this isn't good. Oh, it's not going to work out at all. Oh, Shooter doesn't like it. Uh, that didn't even cause Eddie to move. He just fell asleep. Oh, no, 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 Shooter. Don't do that. Shooter. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dropping Eddie on his head. Oh, that. Somehow, Eddie Osborne is reaching for the rope. He's struggling to the feet. He's on his feet before Shooter. Shooter is down. Osborne is up. Oh, wait, Shooter's up. Kind of. If. Oh, there you go. Shooter was playing possum. He just needed to rest, I guess. Oh, he's back down. Oh, he's back up. I think they both took a bit of that uh, suplex there. It looks like he was going for a draping. Well, stuff. when you have somebody the size of Eddie land pretty much on top of you, it's not hurt. Yeah, he uh, adjusted last second and... Sometimes those end up ugly for both parties here. Hundred percent. Like shooters in control now. Well, shooters in control. Um, uh, what you got to realize? There's like around forty years of wrestling experience in that ring. Sixty if you include him. That's true. Oh, takes the toe right out, and there's that elbow right to the back into the neck of Osborne. Shooter just pounding Osborne. I don't think Osborne's awake anymore. Like, I don't... What's going on here? Like, what's going on? Hey, what's Legacy doing there? What's the 365 Combat Champion doing at ringside? Huh. Legacy's interrupting the match. Devin Shooter. Wait, what, what? Hang on, I'm getting, I'm getting this from the back. What? Okay, we're going down the ringside for referee Tim. Wait a minute, Legacy's taking the mic. Okay. Shooter, that, that's enough, man. I am sick and tired. Okay, what? Coming here every week. 
the, the match has been called. Legacy threw in the towel for Osborne. Legacy what? threw in the towel. Why would you do that? I have no idea. Aren't you supposed to be holding the towel? Yeah, if anybody should, it should be me. And you were sitting right here with me. What the? What? Okay, we'll try to figure out what's going on here. Um, yeah, the match has been called. Legacy is challenged Shooter to the bell. Okay, well, yeah, no, okay. Right. Oh, hey. Let's go to commercial. Sure. All right, we don't have commercial. We have that little promo thing. That's our commercial. Okay. All right. Um, thank you, folks. Uh, my name is Ramon Carlton. This is Sawyer Stein. The socials, all that good stuff. Like us, love my 365 combat champion. Uh, Infinite Legacy, Eddie Osborne, Devin Shooter. Yeah, we're all 365. Let's see if we can figure this one out. What the heck is going on? You got the towel. That was Eddie's shot. He doesn't get another one. Yeah, that's true. I'm bad for him. Oh, you should be. Okay. Um, yeah, right. Alright folks, this is what we know. First off, complete chaos has broken out backstage. Infinite Legacy and Eddie Osborne were seen in an altercation. Devin Shooter got involved. It, anyways, doesn't matter. What we know right now is Eddie's Osborne title shot is done. He's lost it. Bottom of the rankings. However, I've heard rumblings that I haven't got anything official yet, but Devin Shooter may be forced to uh, defend the belt against Infinite Legacy very quickly. But none of that doesn't matter right now. What matters is Mad Max Benson, the guest this week on Caring About Wrestling, um, uh, is uh, making his way into the ring, accompanied by Nolan James, as he takes on um, Javico, the mayor of Uncle Clifton. Yeah, really good it, you know what? It's almost like you've been talking to some of your compatriots. We're often mention them. Uh, they like to take moments. Um, they sometimes take moments a little bit unfairly. That is Nolan James playbook 100%. Um, uh, ever since he's come back, he's been a little bit bitter. I can I can understand why. I can understand why. However, maybe not use the cane that way. That seems to be a little bit abusing it. Oh, it's Javico! go! There he is. I didn't want to acknowledge that clown. That clown's scary. Chases me around the ring. Horrible. Anyways, Javico making his way to ringside, mayor of Monkey Flip City, ringmaster of the Fallen Circus, um, former uh, global champion, global champion, grad champion, global champion, um, former tag team champion, um, he's held belts in multiple promotions. Uh, Hibiko is um, kind of 
kind of brings a little bit of uh, pizzazz, a little bit of spice to the ring. You never quite know what you're going to get. He can do the high flying and he can do the heavy hitting. And I know you're thinking, the Rico heavy hit? Absolutely, 100%. He, kicks are lethal. They, his kicks are lethal. Now he's going against Mad Max Benson, and Mad Max Benson just likes to beat people up. All right, let's go down the ring side. Ref Ronnie uh, asking for the bell. The bell was there. We actually have to put a microphone on the bell uh, so we can hear it at the ringside because this crowd is that loud. Hey, and I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Absolutely. You know, like it has the last 20 times or whatever it is. But uh, it's amazing. It it's just gives you so much energy. It fires you up the moment you step through that curtain. Well, the moment you step through that curtain, the moment you come from the back, you feel the energy, you know the energy. There is nothing like live, independent, local pro wrestling. All right, here we go. Benson uh, going in full force, has a waist lock uh, on Haviko. Haviko able to get out of it, though. Oh, and tosses Benson right over. You see? Headlock takeover. Yeah. He loves that one. He does. Oh, but Benson counters. Vico trying to struggle, but Benson wasn't doing the, the hippie thing where you get the extra pressure. See, he didn't do it. I know that. Nope. Vico uh, showing uh, Benson what he feels. Crowd echoing his sentiments. Max up to his feet. Grabbing the tosses. I'm not supposed to do that. Benson in control, but Haviko able to get out of it. A little bit of a counter-offensive. Benson ducks. Benson catches Haviko. Haviko ducks. Benson catches Haviko. But Haviko tosses Benson. Haviko uses Benson's own mask, did some Newton stuff, and yeah, now he's going up. Two more, but that's okay. Oh, wait. Benson woke up. He probably should have used the two. Oh, Benson oh, caught him. Caught him in there. Oh, he definitely should have used the two. What's Benson doing? What the heck is Benson doing? Whatever Benson was doing, Vico got out of it. And Nolan James is not impressed. I wouldn't be impressed. Hey, wait. Oh, Okay, um, not technically illegal because he did it to his own person, and uh, it was the cane though. Benson out there trying to figure out um, what he should do. Vico not really sure what he should do. Benson outside. Nolan James outside. Havico also now outside. Uh oh. 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 This is super kick. You see, you always got to watch for the second one and for that elbow, that knee. Sorry. And Nolan James saying, "I don't want any of this. Just so leave me out of it," which is smart. But stop provoking. Hey, he is honking his nose. Benson back in the ring. Kind of like a clown. 
of equal uh, also in the ring picking Benson up forearm or elbow to the head of Benson Benson in the corner we're going for a monkey flip but wait Nolan James uses the cane to stop Benson from being flipped which causes Vigil over Benson's oh, pick picked him up, up. Jack Knight roll through Oh, poor Avico! Oh, but Avico kicks out. Good for him. Oh. Maxwell Benson with a huge white noise on Avico. Avico barely getting his shoulder up at two and a half. Absolutely, and um, uh, Benson just taking fists to the face of Avico, pounding and pounding and pounding, pounding, pounding. Now Benson is up and fired up. Benson is, is definitely fired up. Vico trying to get up, and Nolan James actually looks happy. You know. Oh well, what? I don't think you're supposed to do that, Benson. Really, you're not supposed no, to do that. No, no. I didn't think. I know. I knew that. No, no, no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ref. Very menacing. Oh, almost taking Avico's head off. Benson now dragging Avico to the middle of the ring. Goes for a pin. Only a two count. Not even close to being three on that one. Uh, Nolan James giving some words of advice to Benson, who picks Avico up by the tassels. Well, and he's still up. Avico's got him. Slip behind. And got him in a sleeper. Max trying to reach for the rope there. Avico oh, changing tactics puts him into, into an arm bar of sorts. This is oh, he's definitely stretching. Oh, Benson feeling the pain, but he's able to get out of that one. Has Avico back up. Avico back applying the pressure on the neck, and Benson just backs into the corner. And then meets him with the forearm. Oh! Big spear. What's a backward somersault spear thing? Kicks the feet out of Havico. Off the ropes. Oh, and the knee right into the face of the chinny chin chin there. Nolan James looks on with Lee. Pin. Only a two count. And Benson's upset. Well, Benson's always upset, so that's not new. Benson being pulled up, or sorry, Benson pulling Havico up. He's got him up again. Putting him on the ropes. In the corner there. Now he's, uh, Benson also on the ropes. I think I know what he's going to do, and, and he really shouldn't. This isn't going to end well. This isn't going to end well. Oh no, oh no. Havico's fighting. Fight, Havico! Fight! Fight! Avico's fighting, but so is Benson. Neither in control up there. They're in very precarious territory. Uh oh, oh headbutt, and Benson goes down. But Avico's still up. Avico's up. Avico's climbing. He's calling Benson to his feet. Benson doesn't know where he is. Turns around. Avico flies. Cross bar. Hey. Oh, Avico bounced right off. He had some hang time on that. He had some hang time. Um, and wow, he just bounced right off of Benson. And he's also down, trying to power up. Ref Ronnie is in the middle of the count. Only have the 10. Nolan James trying to... Well, he's actually not trying to do anything. That's oh, strange. Vico's up, Benson's up. Vico ducks off the rope, flying elbow. Benson caught it. Oh! Vico on a row. Oh, big boot to the gut. Oh, right to the back of the neck. Oh. Another big shot. Everywhere. The vehicle's fully in control. Pin him. There we go. We got the pin. And the vehicle had to break the pin as he saw Nolan James coming in. Oh, the heartbreak right there. Like, that should be Havico's victory as we are speaking. Like, seriously. 
Vigo trying caught by Benson. Benson drops him down. Going for the pin. Only a two count. Benson does not have the power that he normally has. Um, he does have the rage, though. In fact, that may be extra rage today. Pulling Haviko off out of the ring onto the apron. The hardest part of the ring picks Haviko up. Haviko fighting. Benson's momentum stopped. Haviko has Benson. Oh! Oh! Ouch, that was onto the floor. And they, they, that's, that's not padded. That's just wood and a lot of varnish. Like a hundred years worth of varnish, but that just makes it harder. All right, Haviko's pulling Max up by his feet, tosses Max into the ring. Has a Max few words for no one. He's going to be feeling the effects of that one for months. I can guarantee it. Oh, that's oh. that's not. You're not supposed to do that. Max has him up. Oh. oh! I think that's all she wrote. No way. He kicked out. No. He kicked out. No. Oh, well, well, good for him. That's crazy. Oh, it's absolutely crazy. I mean, good for him. He's nuts. But yay, this match continues. Max is in shock right now. Max is in totally shock. shock. Nolan James is distracting the referee. Hey, there's Zach Andrews. And he's got his own cane. And he isn't messing oh. with it. Okay. What just happened? Zach Andrews and Haviko and the Fallen Circus. Got him up. And we got a kill switch. And it, oh. oh. <laughs> Zach Andrews. Where the hell did Zach Andrews come from? He's back. Hey. It went for Zach Andrews. Awesome for Haviko. A spectacular for the Fallen Circus. Not so good for Nolan James or Mad Mac Benson. Oh, uh, Mad yeah, okay, what a match. Okay, that was awesome. Hey, um, uh, speaking of matches, you got one. Um, it is going to be a fatal five way. Hang on, hang on. You are going against Brett Matthews, Josh Cadwell, Zach Andrews. Zach Andrews? Yeah. Zach Andrews and Lax and Arthur. What? I know. It's crazy. Back right now. It's crazy, but that's what it says right here on my piece of paper. All right, let's find out what's going to happen. Well, if you haven't yet, folks, check out your social. Check out our social, 365 Pro Wrestling. You'll find us everywhere. Wait, our 365. That's what it says right there. Zach Andrews. I gotta go. I gotta need to All right. with 365 Pro Wrestling and I am here with Josh Cadwell and that is some crazy hardware you got going on there. What is up with that necklace? That's awesome. Did you say something? Are you talking to me right now? Um, yeah, you're here doing an inter interview for 365 Pro Wrestling. Okay, what, yeah. What do you want? What do you want? Uh, I was just uh, wondering about your, um, the your hardware there, that's some... Oh, the scissors that I stabbed Eddie Osborne with in the face? Those are the actual scissors? Yeah. That is crazy. Is there, like, any blood residue left on there? No. I don't know what the heck Eddie Osborne has. I, I made sure to clean these things as soon as possible. That's good. That's good. They do look very shiny, so it seems like you probably... Do you do a very good job cleaning them, which is awesome. I so I possibly did. Um, but hey, so we're here at wrestling uh, in Victoria and just wondering, like, 
What you got going on for a match tonight? Yeah, uh, I was supposed to face Sawyer Stein, uh, one of my biggest enemies, but unfortunately, I think he may have gotten to uh, management somehow and made this into a uh, fatal five-way match. Five-way? Yeah, I gotta wrestle Sawyer Stein, Laxadartha, Brett Matthews, and Zach Andrews, some of the biggest men in 365. Whoa. I think they're trying to stack the deck against Josh Cadwell. But I'm sure you are gonna handle that no problem, right? I mean, look at me. I mean, Obviously, I got the scissors. Yeah. I got the muscles. Yeah. You got it all. Yeah, I'm glad that you said it. All right, well, I mean, you heard it here first. I guess we'll find out what happens after that five-way match, but. No, we're not gonna find out what happens. We know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna win. He's gonna win, ladies and gentlemen. All right, you heard it here first. I'm Karen, this is Josh Cadwell, and we are 365. Is that mic on?
Cause it's real rap dude and it's nothing you can handle Dismantle with the nambo cause I like to break shit Take shit apart and reassemble to my interest It's business, what you expect? Big city soldiers pistol whipping with no regrets No stress, we on the front lines Ready for war, no telling what's in store When we break down your door and put you on the floor Don't say no more
the intern. This is 365 Pro Wrestling. And I just saw a crazy five way match with Black Sidorica. Tara, I'm sorry. Tara, you hold this. I'm not. Yeah, I go back. I don't. 365 Nation, we have been here time after time again. Four ways, triple threat, fatal five ways. It doesn't matter. He doesn't lose when it's one on one. How come he can't have a one on one match? We want a one on one match for that belt. Come on, this is Lax and Arthur. It's okay. You have! I shall do the Lord! We can't control him for much longer. Alright folks, welcome back, 365 Combat, and I'm sitting here with Ramon Carlton, sitting here next to Sawyer Stein. How's that feel? Yeah, not a song. Eh, we're doing a cover fest there, I see. Anyway, um, uh, okay, um, uh, well, you know what, hey, you said you wanted to be out there, and the wild lows were there, and that's what happened. Um, okay, but, back to the present, right now, Judas. Icarus is in the house. 365 combat, one half of the center and same combat, uh, sorry, um, uh, tag team combination. And um, uh, he is here and he's taking on none other than Inferno. Now, let's talk about Judas Icarus. Is there a belt he hasn't had? Like, in, in, in local independent pro wrestling here in the Pacific Northwest, I mean, Judas Icarus is synonymous with the word win. Win, win, win. Love him, hate him, doesn't matter. I mean, tag team championship, global championship, champion championship, all the champ. Judas Icarus. Oh, absolutely. It was a great match. I mean, it was, yeah, like Judas Icarus. So AM the school. And tonight he's going to go against Inferno, who is literally on fire. Literally. Yeah, I know he wasn't trying. That one just happened. I know it's great. It's great. Yeah. You're the one that said it. Anyways, anyways, we got Inferno here because it's not the same without the flame. A member of the Fallen Circus. Loves the fly. Uh, he can. He yeah, loves the fly, and he can fly here. Some folks are worried about the height of the White Eagle Polish Hall. Heck, I see this guy in Campbell River. He literally pushes the ceiling tile out of the way, does his stuff, and then after the match, pushes it back. No, I'm really sorry. I had to do that, but he does. Flying, not a problem at the White Eagle Polish Hall. Because guess who also can fly? Yeah, that's true. But he feels like he can, but he's been hit hard lately, and uh, he's been so technically amazing. His game plan before every match has been awesome. He's definitely been playing really hard. He studied my offense and uh, worked out for sure. He's one step ahead the whole way. And, uh, yeah. Ferdinand's got to be careful that he's going to be is definitely going to play his part in his uh, match here tonight. Uh, basically, whoever has the best offense is probably going to come out winner. And uh, these guys are ready to go. I don't know if you just saw that. They were nose oh. to nose for a second. Nose to nose, toe to toe. They are ready to go blow for blow. 100%. I can't wait to see it. All right, here we go. Main event, 365 Combat. Thanks for joining us. Let's get this one started. Uh, hopefully, referee Tim Chase on can keep things under control. Vico and uh, Judas Icarus sizing each other up. Lock up. Whoop. 
Thank you. Thank you. Infernal. My apologies. I don't scary he lives in my head. And he was just out there. Infernal. And Judas Icarus. And Infernal ducked, uh, showing the absolute speed that he has. Judas Icarus um, uh, appreciating it, actually appreciating it there. Seeing that he has a little bit of his uh, work cut out for him today. Absolutely. Infernal, great on that waist lock. Reversal by Judas, though. Speed of Inferno. Oh, Inferno showing everything here. Uh, his speed, his agility, and he's going to need it all if he wants to stand a chance, which he is standing. Because on the other side, Judas Icarus is actually having to work, which is probably surprising. Working that arm. Judas Icarus looking for a weak spot, finds it, flips Inferno over, locks him in. Judas Icarus and Inferno fighting, uh, trying to find Domus as uh, Judas uh, is definitely in control here at the moment, but Inferno fighting his way up. Back in that waist lock, another reversal. Inferno trying to get out. Judas Icarus uh, letting him out by the looks of it, but went for a blow, unable to get it. Inferno locks him in. Judas Icarus spins around. Oh, that was, oh, oh, but nobody's home for that. Just missed the stomp. But nobody was home. Judas Icarus using his speed right there to get out of the way. Flips Inferno around. He uses his agility to say, hello, how's it going? And uh, Judas Icarus is not happy about that whatsoever. Oh, oh. Gonna kick. Yep. Oh, Inferno on fire. Oh, there we go. Oh. Fire. It's going to take a little bit more than that. It's going to take a lot more than that to keep Judas Icarus down. Um, uh, okay, you know, working on a body part, definitely something you can do. Definitely. Yeah, we're liking it. We're liking it. Oh, he caught it. Caught it. Tossed it. Ducks the line. Infernal tosses him over. Off the ropes. Tosses him over again. What do you know? Oh, what a drop kick. kick. That was a big one. And only a two. Infernal uh, sizing up Icarus, who's trying to call himself up in the corner there. Picks him up there. Big chop. Icarus goes to the other corner. Infernal falls. Oh, another one. That is going to leave a mark till probably uh, three weeks from Thursday. As will oh, that is he just smacked the pole. But it doesn't matter because Judas Icarus has him locked in. Taking advantage of the distraction. Leaves him draped over the ropes. Twisting the arm of Inferno around but forgets about the other one that delivers a big blow. Well, the ropes ducks two lines. Does not duck the third one. Inferno down, Judas Icarus menacingly standing over Inferno, looking around. He's planning his next move here. He is, Inferno's up. Oh. oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, he tosses him on the rope. Not what I was expecting. Doesn't matter, off the corner. Oh, that was even more devastating, I think. Big knee to the ribs. Oh, Inferno flops to the outside, but he's up. He's just sitting, kind of. Trying to gain stamina, not going to gain it that way. Massive knee to the back of the spine. Inferno's on the outside. Might be down for a minute here. Referee starting the count. Referee starting the count up to two. Judas Icarus sitting uh, quite happily in the middle of the ring. Inferno pulling himself in. Judas Icarus up to his feet in time. Big boot. Oh, tosses him over by the neck. Oh, oh kicks him in the back. Big kick. Oh, that, that's got to hurt. And just tosses Inferno over. Judas pulling him out this time. 
beating him down in front of the 365 Nation. Beating him down, um, big fist there. Oh, Inferno is draped over the crowd as uh, Judas Icarus keeps going to uh, work on him. Massive double chop. Massive double chop. Judas Icarus showing his appreciation to the other side of the crowd, getting them fired up as uh, Inferno is being counted out on this side. Inferno crawls back in. Judas Icarus looking to the ref. Oh, but should have been paying attention to the ref because uh, Inferno wants to fight. Oh! Beautiful suplex there. There we go. Oh, 22 count. Inferno kicks out. That's very odd for him to do, but okay, yeah, let's do it. Why not? Keep going. Well, even if you catch Judas Icarus off guard, that is exactly what's going to happen. You think he's uh, not paying attention, but now he's plotting. He's figuring out. He's 15 chest moves ahead of you. He's got Infernal up. Infernal's fighting. Infernal's able to get out of it. Oh, well. Icarus did not see that one coming. Pushes uh, Infernal into the back, though. Able to counter. Infernal up and over. Oh, and... Oh! Oh, but Infernal's down. Infernal's up. And Judas Icarus is down. Okay. And everybody's down. Okay. Everybody's down except for the ref. That's an easy place for us to restart here. Figure out what's going on. Nope. They're both up. Big kick from Judas Icarus who tosses. Inferno out of the ring who catches himself. Icarus has not realized this though. Yeah, he held on this time. Oh, no. Icarus has no idea he's there. Oh, Icarus does know he's there. And Inferno still able to bait him. But Judas Icarus able to stop it. Oh, 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 big back elbow. All right, finally Judas Icarus is able to connect Inferno draped on the ropes. Oh, twists Inferno's arm around. Oh, big blow to the face. Oh, he's still got a hold on now. Icarus not letting go. Icarus not letting go at all. Oh, pulls in for oh, Inferno uses every last ounce of strength he has and just pulls uh, Judas Icarus into the pole there. Oh, off around the pole. Post one nine. Post one nine catches Icarus, who's now down. Inferno going up. Misses the stomp. Oh, he flew right through. He flew right through. We should have saw that one coming. Everybody should have realized that one was coming. Inferno just flew right through the ring, catching Judas Icarus. Both are down. Inferno trying to drag himself. Inferno, Inferno's back up. Okay. He forces a, uh, Judas Icarus up, tosses him into the ring. That is awesome. All right. Let's see more awesome now. Oh, here we go again. Let's do it one more time. One more time? Nope, no more times. Okay, we'll do that. Launched him into the corner. Yeah. That works. We'll count that as a time. Oh, oh, oh! Huge basement drop kick. Going down low, had him in the corner there. He missed that stomp though. Oh, caught him. Up on the ropes. Oh, but he's able to land it. Ducks the elbow, ducks it again, catches it, ducks it, lands it. That's a double stomp in. It's like a bebop game. Infernal style. That's a pen. Oh, but it, Judas Icarus is able to kick out at the last millisecond. Well, I thought Infernal had that. And the crowds it too. Oh, we got a double count happening here up to four. There's five. Oh, sorry, three. A little bit of stirring there on the bat. These guys got There's five. Infernal is up. Infernal is up. 
Infernal is going even higher up. Where is he going? He's going up. up. Why is he doing this? Judas is on his feet. Judas catches him. Judas is also going up. Oh, this is. Oh, Judas is down. Inferno pushes him off. Inferno continues. Inferno jumps over Judas. Again, the back elbow catches Inferno. And the boot. Oh, but uh, Inferno caught the leg. Oh, he hit it. Wow. Okay. Judas Icarus is down. Inferno is going to win this match. I guarantee you. I did not guarantee it. Wow. That was a Judas huge Icarus kick by Judas. kicked out of that one. Inferno cannot believe it. The fans are beside themselves, and the referee is counting again. Inferno's up. Judas Icarus is not. Inferno's out of the ring. Judas Icarus catches his leg. Big boot, though, breaks Icarus off. What's Inferno going to do here? Oh, it doesn't matter. Judas Icarus caught him, literally caught him, and is working on that arm now. Just pulling it over that rope. Oh, this is not good at all for Inferno. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, he's not letting go. Sawyer, he's not letting go. Oh! Oh, you should have let go. How's that? Oh, Inferno! Judas Icarus saw it coming. He's fired up by it. He's not waiting for Inferno to stand up. He has Inferno up. Oh, oh, Inferno fights out. What the heck? Runs away to the corner. Oh, oh but not enough, big boot. Oh, ow, ow. Pushes Inferno. Oh. Oh, just stay down, Inferno. You don't want no more. You don't want no more. Inferno wants more. Why? Oh! Oh! Judas just pin him! There we go! And he kicked out? Why? Why in Bejeepers anything would he kick out? I can't believe he did. That doesn't make any sense. I guess he wants to win. Sure, that makes sense. But wow! Okay, this one continues. Judas Icarus was not expecting uh, Inferno to kick out at all. Um, I wasn't even. Nobody was. Inferno kind of is awake. Judas Icarus picking him up. Inferno asking for the ropes. Judas Icarus more than happy to toss Inferno on the outside of the ring. Oh, this is where Judas Icarus is the happiest, I'll tell you that. Goodness. And it doesn't matter if this ends in a no count out or double count out or what count out. Judas Icarus will just keep the brutality going here all night long. All right, folks, they're, they're heading over to... Oh no, wait, Judas Icarus is back. He's asking the crowd to move. Oh no, no, he's gonna slam him. He's gonna slam him right into the chairs. Oh, here it comes, here it comes! Oh! Oh! Oh, the poor chairs! And, and poor Inferno! I mean, yeah, and the chairs, and Inferno, and the fans got nowhere to sit at the moment. And Judas Icarus is very happy. And uh, the referee is trying to get restore order, and there is no order. We have Inferno being pulled back to the ring, kind of. At least they're at ringside. That's 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 an improvement. Judas Icarus is in the ring, taking a moment and back out. All right, Inferno trying to survive. Judas Icarus uh, fully in control. Really Count is at who finally? Oh, big elbow. Hey, wait a minute, that's Inferno fighting. Why are you fighting back? Oh, that's good. Oh, not so good. Not for long. Not for long at all. Well, the chairs are back, that's good. Okay, Judas has Inferno picking him up in what looks like a fireman's carry on the apron. This is not gonna turn out well, not at all. Oh, I, oh no, oh, wait a minute, Inferno's fighting, Inferno's fighting, Inferno's out. Inferno catches Judas Icarus's leg, puts it on the rope, oh! oh. Oh, a huge double stall. Mama, mama, mama. To the outside of the ring. That double stall was huge. That double stall was beyond a huge. Inferno dragging himself back into the ring. Um, we got the count still happening on the outside to Judas Icarus. He's up on. He rolls in. 
neither competitor in fighting uh, stance here at the moment. Judas Icarus is trying to pick himself up. Infernal's on his knees. Oh, we have blow. We have a blow from uh, Infernal. Will Judas reciprocate? Judas is on one knee. Judas is trying to fight. Judas is on his feet. Okay, that's good enough. We're going at it. We got a blow from Judas. We got a blow, blow, blow from Infernal. Judas says no. Oh, it only takes one. And Infernal is knocked down to his knees again. As Judas Icarus stalks his prey, Judas with a weak-handed blow, not sorry, Infernal with a weak-handed blow to Judas, a strong blow from Judas, matched by another strong blow from Judas, sends Infernal down to his down. Dude, Infernal's that, out. He's crumpled. He's out. Somebody should throw the towel for this match. Where's legacy when you need? Yeah, where's legacy when you need him? Throw a towel in. I'm, where do I go? All right. Okay. So is Infernal. Infernal is begging for more. He doesn't quit. Oh, it just pounded the ton protected toe. toe. Oh, and he caught the other toe. There's only two toes. Well, there's ten, but he caught him. Oh. Oh. oh, oh. Wow, that hurt. Oh, that hurt. Oh, it doesn't matter. Oh, it definitely hurt. Oh, it really hurt. Oh, Judas Icarus is down. This is Inferno's game right here. Absolutely. Oh, Inferno is going up. If Inferno connects, if Inferno lands this, this is it. Inferno will win. Will hey, wait a minute. It's Travis Williams. Oh, it's Travis. Oh, dude. And Inferno is able to fight Travis Williams off. But now, oh. Oh, he's taking he, out the other half of Sinner and Saint. He did. Travis Williams is down on the inside, but the effects are done. Infernal's shoulder has been damaged. Judas oh, Icarus oh, takes advantage of the referee distraction. Roll him up! Oh, Infernal kicks up. Roll up! Oh, Judas Icarus kicks up. He ain't happy about that. Off the ropes! Oh, but G Infernal kicks Off the ropes! Oh, God! Today, not with my move. Oh, face plant. Uh, on the ropes. Getting face fired face. up. Oh, Infernal asking for it. He knows this is it. He is done for. He is asking for it. Off the ropes. Oh, Infernal's down. Judas Icarus is fired up. Picking Inferno up, Inferno stands. Oh, it doesn't matter. That's it. This is over. Here we go. One, shot. two, three. Oh, what do you know? Judas Icarus, one half of the Sinner and Saint Tag Team combination, picks up the win. Can we, can we see that? Let's see that again. Here we go. Lining it up. Wow. Oh, dead Inferno. All right. Uh, folks, if you haven't yet, check out our social medias, uh, YouTube, Twitch, Instagram, all of them, we have them all. Facebook, most definitely. 365 Pro Wrestling, also check out 365 PW Productions on Facebook where you can keep up on all the latest information of your favorite 365 Pro Wrestling. My name is Remote Carlton, this is Sawyer Stein, we... R365. Mumble rap is a stab. Set you up like a trap, dude. Ready for spaghetti, have your brains all mush like rag. Because it's real rap, dude, and that's nothing you can handle. Dismantle with the nambo, cause I like to break shit. Take shit apart, reassemble to my interest. It's business. What you expect? Big city soldiers pistol whip it with no.